Tablets, 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 tablets. Welcome to another This Week in Linux Brief. After CES, the biggest news is that everybody and their mother is trying to build a tablet. At Chromium.org, they have placed up some UI concepts for a Google Chrome OS tablet. There's a little more than concept art at this point, but there is a video demoing what it should be like when they get done with it. And across the pond in the UK, there's a company called X2 that has created their own tablet, which they're actually calling the iTablet. It will run Windows 7 or Linux, it has a 1024 by 768 display, and will come in either 10.2 or 10.7 inch sizes. It looks like it's got all the things that the iPad should have had. It's got a 1.6 GHz Atom processor, a 250 GB hard drive, USB ports, stereo speakers, Wi-Fi connectivity, Bluetooth, 3G, a built-in 1.3 megapixel webcam, multi-touch is going to be an added feature for the iTablet, so that's going to affect price a little bit. Speaking of which, price has not been announced for the iTablet yet. Either way, the iTablet looks kind of like what the iPad should have been. It's a netbook that has been turned into a tablet. Well, that's all for this week in Linux Brief number two. I'll see you next time. Tablet!